Ewa Guan Bedrin. <laughs> you're here because you're probably wondering, hey, how do I install MSH's Flower Pet system? Well, it's actually pretty simple. Now, a part of the system does require the Creator Companion to be installed. You should have it installed because this is what's required in order to upload avatars to VRChat now. So, when you have your project open in the Creator Companion, click on Avatars 3.0 Manager and make sure that it's installed to your project. Next, you're going to want to click and drag the Follower Pet Unity package that you just got from Gumroad and you're going to want to click Import. Once it is now inside of your Unity, go into the MCH Follower Pets 2 folder. Then you're going to navigate into the pet that you just bought, the Feline of Terra, which is our example. Then we're going to go to prefab.feline and click and drag Follower Pet right onto the avatar itself in the hierarchy. Once you do that, it should automatically set itself up in place. Everything is where it needs to be. That is actually perfect. Now, the pet works. You can upload this avatar right now and it will follow you around in game perfectly exactly how you want it. Now, for this next step, if you want the pet to be able to sit down in place or follow the players or toggle off, then you're going to need to follow the, these next steps. Now, in the first step, I told you to install the AV3 manager, which is this. You can open that by clicking on VR Labs, Avatar 3.0 manager. Then you click and drag the avatar to the descriptor spot right there. Click down on FX, and this should already be in place. Click on Add Animators and Merge, and we're going to want to navigate to the Follower Pets folder. Then you'll see pet.fx. Click and drag that here. Make sure all of these are blank. And now you want to click on merge onto new. That way we don't overwrite any FX layer that we previously had in case we break things. On pet.int and pet.y, make sure we check both of those so that they end up on our avatar as parameters. And then almost last but not least, go back to our avatar, check the main menu, go to the main menu or whatever uh, 3.0 menu you have. I'm gonna add control. We want to name this control pet menu, add a sub menu, search for menus, and we're going to want to put the pet menu sub menu. This will allow us to control our pet as far as it's toggling, staying, following other players, or its Y location while it's following other players. And last but not least, there is one bug that causes the pet to teleport after you toggle the staying command off. In order to fix that, just click and drag, move to top, pet stay, follow, and toggle to the top, just like so. And if you come up with any other issues with the pet, like things not toggling correctly, make sure you have the avatar in your avatar uh, 3.0 manager, and make sure you select WD and set, set WD on. That will set your right defaults to on, and that should fix your avatar. And boom, you're ready to upload. There's nothing else you need to do and you can go ahead and test the avatar in game with all of its lovely commands. Now a few things you may want to take note of. Let's say you want to change the location of where your pet is. Do not move where follower pet is located. Instead, you want to click on pet location and you can change where the pet is located by moving this. You can even make the pet float in the air, stay on the floor. Just do not change anything that is within follower pet here other than moving pet location. Now, if you do want to change the scale of the pet, then you will go into main pet container and click on pet container, and you can change the scale of this however you like. Make the cat giant, and it won't affect a single thing. It just makes the pet bigger. And there you have it. That is how you install my follower pet system. And if you have any further questions, go ahead and feel free to ask them in the comment section below, or you can just hit me up on Discord. And uh, that'll be all for today's video. And if you guys like today's video, then go ahead and leave a like. Yeah, you subscribe to it, you want to become part of the homie family, then go ahead and do so. And I'll see you guys later. Peace and much love.